My Journey to Laza was written by a French woman called Alexandra David Neal in the 1920s. The book follows the final stages of her incredible 14-year journey around Asia. I've decided to attempt the first leg of her trek using and wearing only what was available to her back in the 1900s. It was yak wool that my mum knitted. The real challenge now lays ahead to reach Mount Kenchenjunga base camp before the weather turns bad and we have to turn back. According to Janggu, we're about 4,500 <clears throat> metres. It's so hard to breathe with the altitude. We set off this morning from the camp below, six hours later and 500 metres higher and you can see what the weather's like up here. If it's like this, we're not allowed to go up. At this weather, there's no clouds, we can carry on up. Oh, wow. We finally made it, and these are the same views of mountains that Alexander David Neal would have seen. Kanchenjunga is actually the third highest mountain in the world, and it's very, very sacred. So here we are, Jungu. Yeah. At the Green Lake, did you think we'd make it? We were positive, <laughs> and we did it. It wasn't just my own persistence that got me here. My journey in Sikkim wouldn't have been the same without my wonderful guide Jangu and Emily, our camerawoman, who felt all the challenges along with me. And I think we're probably friends for life now. I suppose if there was one thing I could hope for, it's that this journey might inspire other women to step outside their comfort zone and do the things they've always wanted to do.